So this isn't my normal video, but my camera died. And so I'm doing this for you at night to test out the low light capabilities of my phone and also uh, to show you a cool trick that I learned a long time ago around the campfire. So when I was younger, and you probably did this too, you used to throw soda cans into the fire and watch them explode and blow stuff all over the place, but it also half put out the fire. But there's something a lot cooler that you can do with a soda can that's full with a campfire. And I'm gonna show you what to do. And the first thing you have to do is open it. And then the second thing you have to do is put it in the fire and let it cook. And I'll show you at what point you should pull it out to get a really awesome result. in the fire. Find a nice little spot where it's going to stay up right Set it, whoop, and it poured out. Ah. Well, we'll see how that one does. Whew, that's real hot. Make sure you don't burn yourself doing this. See it boiling out of the can? Not ready yet. The life of a YouTuber. Sitting around the campfire alone, cooking cans of Pepsi. That's what we do. I got that can way too hot. Completely melted. See it right there? Melted. Done. This one, on the other hand, is doing all right. It's still sizzling, working its way. We're waiting for flames. See that? Fire coming out the can. Take a guess what that is. What could possibly put up that much flame from inside of a Pepsi can? Sugar. Lots and lots of sugar. As soon as that flame stops, I'm gonna pull that can out. It's getting low. Not much flame left. Oh, stop. It's close. It just got smashed by a log. I'm gonna pull it out. Try number two. Got a couple more cans, and I'm gonna do this again. Science. Numero uno. Bam. Look at that. Dirty boiling. Number two. All right, time to wait. We got fire. Look at that. That can is going. That's what we're looking for. Like a blowtorch. Look at it go. It's ready to pull out. Ha <laughs> ha. That's what she said. Can number two is losing its mind. Going crazy. Stuff coming out all over the place, all on fire. Whew, look at it go. Holy cow. These are the first two attempts. They look pretty cool, but they're small. These two are the awesome ones. I dremeled them in half already because the can didn't burn up. This one, which is not quite the size of the can, but it still looks amazing. It looks like glass through most of this area here. And I'll show you close-ups of these in a second. And uh, then this is the other one. And half the can burned through, stirred this part a little bit. And there's that one. So all of this is sugar, burned up sugar. Sugar is very similar to a fuel. That's why all this flame shot out of the can, and that's why you get this carbon block left over, because everything burns off except for the carbon, because there's lack of oxygen going. Anyway, it doesn't matter. They look amazing. They're so cool looking. You see this close up, it's like there's little caves and divots all through it, and it looks like it's made out of black glass. It's, these are fantastic. I'll show you close ups. Thanks for watching. By the way, it's light as a feather. These weigh nothing. looking at Pepsi. How does that make you feel? Gross. You're drinking that. Obviously after a chemical change, but still.
super easy science experiment. 